Hey, Trip Zero here with another hole in the ground. This is actually a about a three foot deep hole that I've jammed this uh, PVC pipe down. And then I've put a, drilled a hole here and put a fogger in. This is a four inch tube. And this is actually the the, uh, the male or the female end. Uh, so you could connect two pipes together. I stuck a fogger in there. And um, the idea is here, I want to make a fog ponic tower outside and I want to um, keep it cool enough and that's what the hole is for, to get some geothermal uh, cooling so that uh, the, uh, the temperature of the water with this 24 watt fogger will not get too warm for the roots. Now this is an experiment, I don't know if it's ever been done before but I'm gonna try it out. So I've got the fogger in there and I've got this big long tower that I've inserted green beans into and let's just uh, let's just insert this. So I've already put nutrients in there, I pH balanced this water but it's really simple, to, simple like assembly and so I just stick it in there, it just kind of hangs out, right? And drilled a three inch hole, these are three inch net cups and I've used silicon tape to kind of secure it in, some uh, plastic ground cover, uh, weed barrier type stuff I've used to just kind of hold the plant there and to prevent excess fog from escaping. And I've put, let's see, one, two, three, four, five plants uh, all the way up to the top. And it's about, I don't know, seven feet tall. Um, capped off the top, of course, because we want to seal in the fog. And the only thing I really don't like is I've had to use the silicon tape to kind of hold it in. So it's not terribly secure without it. But I've got, you know, five green beans in here. Um, if I... So, like, examining the roots is going to be a pain because I'm going to have to kind of peel back the tape. Now, Velcro might be a better option. I might look into that um, to hold these in there. But we'll see how this goes. We'll see if it, I can keep it cool. I'm going to go grab some, um, some uh, sand and, uh, bags and just, like, kind of put sandbags around it just to kind of center it so it's nice and centered and also to seal up around the hole. I want to keep the hole, I want to bury this in there because I want to be able to take out the water, change it, uh, put new water in, things like that. Um, so I don't want to be having to redig the hole over again if I seal it up and then pull the pipe out. Uh, but we'll see how this works. This is uh, beginning of May and uh, we'll keep this going over the summer if it works and if it works great so this will be an ongoing thing we'll check back and these have just barely I mean these were bare root so what I did um, I'll just describe how I got these to, to seed because I think it gave me a really good germination rate I was using the Grodan plugs and the, the the beans would just rot in there they wouldn't they weren't sprouting or germinating so I just put a whole bunch of beans in my fogger, my uh, previous green bean uh, five gallon bucket. I've just put a whole bunch of beans in there and they uh, like 100% rate of germination, which is pretty awesome. And these are the results. So I just threw them in the net pot, put the, put the uh, weed barrier in and uh, put them in the tower. We'll see how they do. All right, trip zero out, fog ponic outdoor tower.